Hi, welcome to another Buzzing About Town here on Buzzing Pattaya, and am I in the place that is the talk of the town? Joining me on the show today is Patrick and Jack. How are you doing, guys? Doing okay, yeah, and you? Yeah. You're looking really like relaxed and chilled out, despite the mayhem that surrounded <laughs> you. You like, you know, you just look so chilled. We are, in case you don't know, look behind me. We are here in the most talked about place in the whole of uh, Soibacal, the Pattaya Beach Club, guys. What an incredible concept you've decided to create for us. I mean, what was the thought process behind that? Why, why did you uh, decide we need a swim pool, a beach club, saunas, jacuzzis, nightclub, everything? I mean, what was the thought behind that? <laughs> I don't know if there was a thought, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> Just woke up one morning and thought, Sunday, let's have a club. Yeah, it was more like we're drinking too much and uh, me and Jack started to talk and we've been over here to, to look. Yeah. And we were more or less in... in in the bar drinking when we decided to do something okay now uh, you've got a history here in the nightclubs as well we well, both have haven't you so you, you know what you're doing let's be honest yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we think so you think so so <laughs> we hope so well, yeah, <laughs> i hope so too it looks amazing so jack tell me about the concept here. i mean you know we've been talking a little bit off camera that just tell me some of the facilities that you're going to provide here when this is all finished well basically we'll have beach club nightclub uh restaurant um sauna steam rooms pretty much everything under the one roof so so during the daytime what what's going to happen in the daytime well let's start with the easy part what time do you think you're going to be open from around 12 around 12 yeah. okay so when people come here at 12 o'clock what kind of things can they expect to be happening i mean you're gonna have like a dj or how's that all going to fit in the uh, plan is that dj around between two and three in the afternoon before that we're playing music uh, yeah so it's mainly relaxing okay eating Drinking. I, I see you've got some lovely big cabanas here. Yeah. And there's lots of seating over there. I mean, there's that sunk a bit in the middle. Is that, is that like a foam party venue? Are we going to be like <laughs> sliding into foam later? Or is that a bit, I can't really give that away yet. No, nah, we, we, we keep that. Uh... <laughs> wait and see. Yeah. Leave us yeah. a wait yeah. and see one. Okay. So, I mean, the cabanas and this large space here. I mean, what's going to be here in this large area where we're stood right now? Some beds. Some beds. Okay. Day beds. Okay. Lots of sleeping, hanging overs. Yeah. I mean, we're coming around 12. I mean, Hard night before, hangover. 12? Uh, <laughs> what time do you get in? <laughs> you don't answer that. And on the other side, what's going to happen on the other side? Uh, the more or less the same, but they're going to be more single beds, uh, bean bags, uh, umbrellas. Yeah. Okay. Relaxing. And you mentioned about the stage area here. I mean, we're talking about uh, a DJ. Mm -hmm. And Jack, did you say there was about a live band? Yeah, occasionally, not all the time, but not yeah, sometimes time. we'll have live bands, yeah. So what kind of music will they be playing, or have you not sort of like give that much thought, you're just going to stick one up and say, crack on, boys? Uh, we try. We're thinking about, you know, Filipino band, Thai bands, uh, Falang bands, if they're um, expats yeah. uh, who want to jam. Happy so, days. Yeah. Get a good drum kit, I'll be up there. <laughs> I'll play drum kit, I'll be up there. So during the daytime then, uh, now I know before we were talking about you've got a huge kitchen, haven't you? a massive kitchen, yep. I mean, what kind of uh, food will you have available? More or less everything, everything, uh, Western food, uh, Thai food, and maybe you're going to mix some, because I mean, he's Armenian from the beginning, so probably something from the Armenian kitchen, wow. and yeah. So yeah, it's going to be so a mix. I'm really, I'm so hungry already. <laughs> I mean, to be honest with you, I'm not really worried about food, but I said to you earlier, I do want to jump in that pool. It's, it's just, it's hot today and I want to be in that pool. So you've got the food menu going on, you've got the live music, you've got the DJ, we've got the cabanas here, we've got the sunbeds over there. Opening from around about 12 o'clock you're aiming for. Yeah. What time are we going to close or are you just going to never go home? Never go home. That's, <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's the idea, never go home. That's why we have a nightclub. Well, I was going to say, that's the next bit I want to talk yeah. to you about because up there, uh, you guys can see up there, there's, there's a proper full-on nightclub, in it? Yeah. It's all like soundproofed. Yeah, everything. Everything's going on. I mean, but where did that idea come from? I mean, to be it, honest, it was not me, me, it was him. <laughs> <laughs> it was him. So you're to blame? No, not really. What do you mean, not really? It's it just, it just, it it just progressed to that. But, uh, so, how did that one progress? Over more drinks? Uh, <laughs> pretty much, though, yeah. Pretty much, yeah. Because the plan <laughs> from the, the plan from beginning was, you know, like it was going to be open roof and mm. really, yeah, a little bit more like a lounge. And okay. Then it ended up with a roof, and then it ended up with being soundproofed, and then it ended up with, yeah. 
So when you two get together, do you panic that you think, well, I wonder what we're going to wake up tomorrow and have a beer? <laughs> 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 you think, like, oh, no. Like, we're going to have a beer today. Now, please, let's not talk about the club because who knows what's going to happen. I mean, one of the things that I want to ask you is who, who decided to come to Tree Town? Because Tree Town is under huge, huge speculation. It's going to be the place to be. I mean, was that something you just both thought, do you know what, let's go? Because you've got involvement in other areas in the town. So why, why come to Tree Town? No, but the thing is, is I've been down here and I, I saw this place and, and then I find out that Jack's been here also and so then we went down a couple of times together you know brains were spinning we were thinking this here that there blah 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 and boom and that was it that was it who paid the check bin at the end of that discussion <laughs> <laughs> luckily we were in his bar so we didn't pay <laughs> well that's good I mean in terms of like obviously you you, you know you've got the ideas of the kind of people that are going to come here and they're going to relax etc I mean will will you have like a lot of, of freelance girls is that the plan or you have like hostesses here I mean how do you see that kind of happening what's the uh, the uh, female attraction ratio going to be well I've got him down. I've got him down. <laughs> well, there are going to be guys here, so of course the ladies there are coming. Uh, well, I know. I do know. <laughs> I mean, they, they never say no to a free dinner or a free drink or whatever, so yeah. Oh, I was thinking of getting me one pack out. <laughs> 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 my six went, went a long time ago. I was thinking of getting me one out and seeing if that worked. Because you were mentioning about some kind of, I'm going to say like a beauty competition, but you were saying about the men as well. Oh, a sexy men competition. Sexy yeah. men. Stuff like that. Come on, boys. Vote for me. Vote for me. You need to do something for the guys too. Cannot only have wet t shirts, so we have to have a sexy month man or whatever. Well, I'll tell you what you could do. When it gets close to closing time, you yeah. need them all out. I'll just get the kit off, <laughs> and all the girls will leave, and then the guys are like, sod, babe, you've seen that dude over there, we're out of here. Um, what time will your nightclub open? Um, we haven't decided yet, but... Oh, no, that's not yeah. another round of drinks, is it? You know, uh, you're not going to be out there again. I mean... <laughs> it's open anyway. It's yeah. going to be open anyway, but... Yeah. Um, I mean, It just depends what time we close it off yeah. to the rest of it. You know? Right. Well, maybe around two. So during the day, then that will be open to go up and drink yeah, anyway. Yeah, so if you yeah. want to sit up there, you can drink yeah, out, no the out the sun. If they want to go up, drink, play pool, or stay away from the sun or whatever. Did you mention the word pool? Yeah. As in like, yes. play a pool. You can have a pool table? Of course. Yeah. Two of them. Yeah, two of them. Excellent. Who's the best pool player out of you two? Uh, That's in, me. In for sure. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so pool tables, full on menu, music, cabanas, sunbeds. Possible, I won't say it too much, but possible foam, you know, we'll, mm. we'll, we'll consider that one. Mm. Saunas, I mean, you've got it all. Mm -hmm. You've got it all. I mean, when do I ever get to go home? We got it all, but we have empty pockets. <laughs> For now. Yeah. For now. <laughs> I, I, I can yeah. imagine, I mean, to be fair, all jokes aside, I know we're having a light hearted chat here, but all jokes aside, I can imagine this being like a really popular place. I mean, you've done a fantastic job, guys. You really have. Happy to hear. You know, you, I mean, just walking around. I mean, I was upstairs earlier. I mean, honestly, you want to see the nightclub they put together, the lights and everything. It really does look smart. The stage looks amazing. You know, it really is a very, very good project you've got in. And fair play to you guys. You know, it really, really is good. Question then, near the end of the interview, question, when you can open? <laughs> Nobody knows. It's written in the stars. I mean, the... Uh, we don't need, nobody knows when we can open. I mean, it is what it is. Yeah, I mean, have you got any sort of, in your mind thinking to yourself, well, hopefully by then, I mean. If I would say, yeah, I hope we could open at the end of the month, but uh, I mean, oh, so then the we end have. End of the month? Yeah, but then, we August? Have, but then we have people predicting September, October, mm. so yeah, I mean, we have to follow what the government says. Okay, uh, last question. People that come in and want to come here a lot of time, are you going to have like a membership or anything like that? Yes, memberships. And how will that work? VIP card. Oh, that's oh. secret. That's oh, secret. secret. That's come secret. Come on. <laughs> right, I'm just going to be back in 10 minutes. I'll get them a couple of drinks because apparently when these two are at it, it all comes out and it will get spilled. So I'll be back in 10 minutes. So you are going to have a VIP area? Uh, a VIP membership? Yeah. Any, any, you know, can you give me any, like, <laughs> any, any bits in? Whoosh. Coming, yeah. coming later, coming later. Yeah, well, I did try, guys. Come on, I tried my best. But look at them, they're like, no, I'm not saying that word. It's a bit like the buzzing bar that you lot keep going on. Because well, we're going to open a bar and they keep saying, where, where, where? So I'm not telling you. Yeah. You have to wait. It's just, you know, yeah. under seat. Well, listen, guys, it's been brilliant. Thank you Thank so you. much indeed. I wish you both the very, Thank very best. Thank you very best. much, Jacob. Thank you. Guys, check out, you've got a Facebook page now? Yep. I'll put the link in the description below. Check out the Facebook page there and I'll put all the information in the description below. Come up. I mean, honestly, they've, they've spent a huge amount of money on this. It really does look amazing. Even in its stage now, I can visualize in my mind what this is going to look like when it's all completed. It really is something special. And, you know, you're in the middle of soy cow. You don't even need to go to the beach and it's fantastic. So, guys, when this is open, check out their Facebook page. Keep up to date. I am going to come back 
on the opening day with my VIP, <laughs> VIP bit, you know what I'm you saying? You have it, you will have it, you will have it. So I'm gonna come back on the opening day, we're gonna showcase this incredible, you've done a massive job, it's fantastic. Fair thank, you, thank, thank you, thank you. All right guys, so that's it for me today. Thank you very much for watching us here on Buzzing Pattaya. Remember as always, please hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon if you'd like to know, notified when I bring out a new video. Check out our members area and join our Discord group. More and more people on there. Over 2,000 people are in there now talking about things like this, like these kind of places that it's happening here in our wonderful city. That's it, guys. Thank you very much for watching. And please, wherever you are in the world, as always, stay safe.